and my sister, she lives at Wilf on the other side of Egremont. And um, it was her husband who was outside the house talking to a neighbour. When this guy came up, got the gun out, pulled the window down, got the gun out and um, shot the neighbour dead right in front of him. And he was absolutely horrified. Um, and just at that moment, he went, up, he went just a little bit further up the road, turned round to come back to shoot, to shoot him dead, because obviously he hadn't got him. As my sister came out of the house to ask him if they wanted a cup of tea, and um, realising what had happened, uh, sunk in at the last minute, he grabbed my sister and he said, run. And as they ran to go back in the house, the gunman got the gun and he shot my sister right in the back. And my brother-in-law, Stephen, is absolutely devastated. He's in shock, total shock. Christine's in intensive care at West Cumberland Hospital um, in a very serious condition. Um, she's got a lot of pellets around her heart area and inside of her chest. Um, and she was on like oxygen um, to try and help her breathe because obviously she's got a punctured lung and she's lost quite a lot of blood as well. It's absolutely de devastating. You don't expect something like that to happen around here. And the thing is, it could have been any one of us. It could have passed my house, I could have been in my garden, it could have shot me. I was at Frisington Chip yesterday, just five minutes after it had happened, it could have been me. You know, it's so frightening to think.